Hello, Bina. Would you tell us about Fulades and anything else that you can think of that is how you celebrate Purim and um, uh, things that you can share with our guests today? We know that there is a mitzvah on Purim to have a special seuda, a holiday meal, and to give gifts of food, which we call mishloach manot. All of us have tasted hamantashen, a Yiddish word for the three corner cookies, known in Hebrew as ozne haman, meaning the ears of haman. Haman is a villain in the Megillah who tried to kill the Jews, and in the end, he was arrested and executed. But most of us are less familiar with Sephardic Purim treats, such as huevos de jamán, also known in Ladino as fulares or fularicos. These are hard-boiled eggs wrapped in dough or a pastry, which are called, which are supposed to look like jamán in his jail cell or tied up with ropes. There was also a wonderful custom specifically for Sephardic girls. Sephardic girls would make or receive a different type of fulerico where the pastry or dough was shaped to look like a bird wrapped around the egg. I would suggest that girls should make them look like an owl because that is my favorite animal. <laughs> Here are some pictures of fularis. Start with a basic pastry dough of flour, <laughs> salt, vegetable oil, and ice water or hot water, depending on your custom, and, and of course, eggs. Some recipes call for Parmesan cheese. Take a small walnut sized piece of dough and roll it into a smooth ball, then flatten the ball into a disc about three inches around. Place a cooked egg in the center of the disc of dough. Take the leftover dough and roll it out to two or three rows. The ropes should be about one third inch wide and long enough to go from one side of the disc to the other. Twist the rope and then attach it to one side of the disc. Stretch it over to the egg, attach it to the other side of the disc. This makes the prison cell bars over the egg. Place the fulares on your baking sheet. Bake until the dough is crisp and golden. This should take around 20 minutes. When they are done, take them out of the oven. You can eat them warm or at room temperature. Fularis are usually served at brunch or breakfast or as an afternoon snack. So Bina, is that the same kind of dough that you make for burekas? Um, I don't know. Those are so pretty. Now, Bina, did you cook the eggs before you put them in the cages? Um, no, you cook them all together. Oh, really? Okay. And then also you can um, dye them really any color. I did it with green, but you can also do it like with red or other any colors. Cool. Also, you do it with, um, white vinegar. So you basically just put uh, water, in, hot water in a bowl and then vinegar and some uh, food coloring. Then you stir it all together and put the eggs in.
Now, I was reading too, um, Bina, that some people really like huevos jaminados, you know, the ones that are really creamy and they're brown and they've been cooked. We eat them for Pesach a lot. Do you think that that's something maybe you could do with a huevo jaminado too? Yeah. Very cool. One brain.